From all jewelry and some new frocks with her because presumably because I saw her mouth mouth at the end of it I can't believe it I can't believe this mm -hmm. and uh, so uh, maybe it's a trip to some uh, haute couture office tomorrow to get herself uh, ready for the next match sure although sure he might be well uh, though I probably it might be, well, uh, though I probably can't, but anyway, she'd probably be secreted away on an outside court, yeah. but I, d I don't know who they're going to be putting on show courts now in the third round. They'll be, Murray will be on centre court, but who, who are going to be the rest? I mean, it's, uh, it's a funny, well, this is a, a definitely a funny Wimbledon. Can we get as much drama tomorrow? Uh, probably not. Uh, <laughs> well, I, I don't really want it. I'm exhausted. Uh, just watching it, and I'm... Uh, Burdick, we've got, uh, who's no mug... And we got Serena. Now, if Serena gets beaten, that might surprise. Oh, come anything. on, Rupert. Now, look, you, now, you, you, you're, you're, you're clearly exhausted. You're now talking about Serena getting beaten. It's clearly gone to your head. And, and well, as I've just said off here, if she was in the men, she might well win that now. <laughs> Listen, you get yourself... She, she, <laughs> Listen, you get yourself. She, she could. <laughs> you get yourself back to your hotel room and deal with your shower curtain or, or your, your, your yeah, shower I'm, frame. You I'm on, I've got a shower. I've got a shower curtain. Good. Uh, at the moment, no, because they didn't want to, and I'm told, put me in with another glass one because they thought I might be phobic. Yeah, about exactly. It. Yeah, you said. So I was worried about the shower curtain. I thought I was going to have a psycho moment. <laughs> I thought. I... <laughs> <laughs> well, that's up to you, Rupert. But what you do in the privacy of your own hotel room is entirely up to you. It doesn't happen to Lenny Henry where he where I'm it staying. It certainly at the doesn't. Listen, Rupert, have a great night. Get some sleep, mate. You've had a busy day, Rupert Bell. Get some sleep, mate. You've had a busy day, Rupert Bell. Our man at SW19 and the Keith Moon of tennis, by the sounds of it. Well, clearly, uh, let's uh, well hopefully speak to Peter Taylor, the under 20s coach. Will be joining Tony Evans and myself before nine o'clock after that one-one draw against Chile. You'll listen to kick off on the most extraordinary day at Wimbledon, where Roger Federer has been knocked out in the second round. This is Talk Sport. And extreme sporting action. Two extraordinary men banded together to battle injustice. Fill the rule book full of lead and mo.